Hi guys, I'm Jay. And I'm Adam. And we're from the Movie Preview Review Podcast, mm -hmm. where we review movies just from only watching their previews. Yep. We decided we wanted to do some first responses to some stuff. A lot of cool trailers have been coming out, so we're just going to keep pumping these bad boys out. <laughs> um, apparently today we're watching Bright. Yes, it's the teaser trailer for Will Smith's new movie that's coming out on Netflix. It's called Bright. I know slightly what it's about. Jay doesn't. I didn't um, know it was a thing until five seconds ago when he told me that this is what we're here. I know what's kind of in this trailer, uh, and Jay's going to really like it. So I know there's Will Smith, which honestly is enough as yes. far as sci-fi goes. It is, yeah, I mean, it's a sci-fi film. He's had some misses, but I think he's had more hits than misses. Yes. His last few sci-fi movies have not been the best. After Earth I, I watched movie? Men in Black 3. I didn't oh, did you? it. I didn't hate it. Oh, okay. I actually had fun. So, it's Men in Black. I'll sign up all the time. Anytime. Have you heard that they're, they're maybe doing a 21 Jump Street Men in Black I did. Combo? I heard Which it's, is the, it's kind of in limbo at Hollywood, the I love, I love this idea. But just, please do just it. Just start mixing. Oh my god, please. Just, let's, let's get a gumbo of movies going. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, ooh, that sounds great. We could have Marvel vs. DC. Just fighting. Oh yeah, we could have the Amalgamverse show up. Yeah. Dark Claw? Uh, or I'm thinking uh, Matrix and Hunger Games. <laughs> Matrix Games. I mean, they, they do lend themselves together. Kind of, yeah. Yeah. But like, if like there were like, it was a Matrix world that was Hunger Games, or we exist in a world where you can go, like we as people know the Matrix is real, but like we deal with it and like you can get put into any dimension you want. So like I could live in like the Warcraft dimension. In the Matrix? Warcraft dimension. It's interesting you say that. Let's go to the trailer. Oh, what is this? This land is your land, and this land is my land. What? From the California to the New York Island. This Those land are some sweet shades, man. What? That's an orc. Those are elves. That's a bastard sword. I'm assuming this doesn't end well. I'm pretty sure Bastion Sword has a longer hilt. Okay. Wait, that was it? That's I know, that's unfortunately it. <clears throat> so, Will Smith's a cop, and it looks like LA, in basically like modern day World of Warcraft. What? Yeah! What was that? That was an orc with a shotgun? Uh huh! And huh. elves, and other mystical creatures, and he's a cop. Dude, I'm down on that. Right? That looks great. I mean, just the premise alone. And it's Will Smith. No one sells sunglasses more than <laughs> Will Smith, man. Will Smith is single-handedly the reason the Ray-Bans came back. Mm -hmm. He's like, well, I don't know what he was wearing in that, but I wanted him. I was like, man, those are fly as hell. His I, face is perfect for some, glasses. I would kill some orcs with some sweet shades on. Ooh. Those elves look evil, though, too. Well, they, yeah, they could be. Uh, they could be blood elves. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, but that's a whole thing. It's a whole thing. I know you're a big fan of World of Warcraft. I am. I am. It's kind of like Law and Order Azeroth. Oh, yeah. Yeah! Or, no, it looks like Training Day. <laughs> training Day. Oh, nice. It looks like, yeah, it looks like Training Day of the Rings. <laughs> Combos. Gumbo. L just, uh, just a gumbo. gumbo of things. Just, you know what? Throw in... Throw in some aliens in there, too. Why not? Why not? Come on. I want it all. I don't have a lot of time to watch movies, internet. I don't have a ton of time on my hands. I'm busy making podcasts and YouTube videos. If we're going to put... If I'm going to go see a movie, I want all the things. I want humor. I want mm -hmm. drama. I want I want sword fighting. Ooh, yeah. I want dragons. I want aliens. I want pod racing. Do you? Every movie. You can... We all we all know our thoughts on episode one, but pod racing was awesome. Sorry, not sorry. <laughs> Maybe I'll go into the Matrix universe where pod racing is a thing, mm -hmm. you, and I'll just be a pod racer. You'd be the well, only pod. I'm racer. not force sensitive. I wouldn't be good at it because no, humans not. are good at it. Apparently, you have to be like a weird little monkey man. Whatever. Sebulba. Sebulba. What? I don't know what he was supposed to be. <laughs> but man, that guy could pod race. Guys. Yeah, this I I don't know anything else Can't about wait. this movie. But when this, is this coming out? Hopefully soon, because it looks great. Even awesome. though it was, it was, I mean, just the premise alone, I'm very intrigued uh, with modern day stuff going on in a fantasy world. And if Will Smith is in this movie, 
You know, he doesn't take every project. No. Hopefully his son's not in it. Uh, yeah, that's always... That's become his Achilles heel, kind of. So, as long as Jaden's not in here, or maybe he's an orc. I don't dislike Jaden. Maybe it's he's just like a mouthy whole... orc that gets uh, beheaded at some point. I wouldn't mind not seeing that scene. That'd be pretty cool. No? Maybe that was the sword he was holding. The thing like... I just cut off that movie yes. of the orcs. Yes, that is that is the yep, that was the scene that they showed in the movie. It was like he was about to behead his son in the Uh huh. No. You nailed it, I think. Got it! Got it in one. This guy. That's like, ah, how'd you like Bright? Oh, it was great until like he just it, and it wasn't like Jaden was playing a character he was beheading, like Jaden was like playing himself. <laughs> and like there was like a weird meta moment where Will Smith was like, I'm sorry, but I have to do this. I mean, it was obviously fake. It was staged. It wasn't like they were... But it was, like, very... It was a really weird father-son moment that they had. Yeah, but then it got back to elves and stuff and orcs with shotguns, and it was great. But, like... He, like, even looked at the camera at one point and was like... We all know. <laughs> he winked? He raised his shades and winked? Yeah, but it wasn't a happy wink. It was, like, a sad wink. I don't know if that's possible, but he did it. <laughs> he's he's quite an actor, that Will Smith. He shows range. Ooh, sure to us. Uh, so hopefully, if there is a larger trailer for this movie that comes out, uh, we'll, there's a good chance we'll get to it on the podcast. Oh, yeah. Uh, hopefully it does come out. If not, well, then hopefully we'll do it here again. Um, so let us know what you guys like to see in this movie. Uh, if Orc Lives Matter, let us know. Just in case. Some people some people are whores. Whatever. Some people are lines. Whatever you know. like, uni- movie universe mashups <laughs> you guys want to do. Think about that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we can get some scripts, for, scripts going. Why not? I don't have a ton of time, like I said earlier, but I'm willing to dedicate, you know, a bunch of times to maybe working on a combination of Cannonball Run Ooh. and Bridges of Madison County. <laughs> Just comedy, cars, drama, Meryl Streep, bridges, <laughs> the best bridges, <laughs> Jeff Bridges, <laughs> covered bridges. <laughs> Okay. Wow. Okay, guys. Uh, So until next time. (laughs) See ya. Bye.